Hi everyone, this is the Gas Walkthrough for May 27th. I'm Philip Newman. Today I'm solving Square Dance by Bill Murphy. Uh, earlier in the month, Bill had a diagonal killer, and this is another one. Bill's been messing around with uh, visual themes here. So we have all these cages around the edge of the grid. Um, but we have normal Sudoku rules, 1 to 9 in each row, column, and 3 by 3 box. Additionally, we have the diagonals which also must contain 1 to 9, exactly once each, no repeats. And then we have cages around the grid. All the cages are dominoes in this puzzle, and the number in the top left corner gives the sum of the digits in the cage, so these two digits sum to 9. Those are the rules. And let's get started with our um, minimum and maximum cages. 3 is always 1, 2. And now 7, since it can't contain 1 or 2, the lowest it can be is 3, 4, which is 7. The 11 must now be 5, 6, and the 15 must be 7, 8. That's going to give us a 9 in the 11 cage and a 2 to go with it. Down here, 17 must be 8, 9. And then the highest this cage can be now is 6, 7, which is 13. The highest this can be is 4, 5, which is 9. The highest this can be is 2, 3. And that's going to leave a 1 and an 8 here. The 1 resolves our 2, 1 at the top. Uh, this 7 cage now, there's a 1 and 2 in the column, so this must also be 3, 4. And the 15 can't contain an 8. The only other way to do it is 6 and 9. And that's going to leave 5, 7 in the 12 cage. The 5 here can't contain a 2, so that must be 1, 4. The 8 can't contain a 2 or a 1, so that must be 3, 5. And the 13 is 6, 7, left over. Now let's look at some of these boxes. Uh, we have a 7, 8 in this box, and so this can't be 7. That must be 6, 7. That's going to give us 5 and 7 over here. 2, 3 in this box means this must be 4. The 3 is going to resolve 3, 5 on the other side of the grid. The 4 also resolves 1, 4. The 6 resolved 9, 9 and 6. So that's a good part of the edge done. Let's look at our other cages here. 17 again must be 8, 9. The 9 cage is surprisingly restricted here. Um, it can't be 1, 8 because of the 8 in this cage. Can't be 2, 7. Can't be 3, 6. So it must be 4, 5, and that's going to give us 3, 4 here. 5, 4 here, and 2, 3 here. Uh, the 8 cage now, the remaining digits we have are 1, 3, and 7, so this must be 1, 7, and we know the 7 can't go here. That's going to resolve 6, 7, and 5, 6. Our remaining digit here is 3, it needs to go with a 5 to sum to 8. This is 4. These are 7 and 8. Uh, but this is in a 10 cage, so it can't be 7 because it would need a 3. Must be 8, 2. The 15 now must be 6, 9, just like this one. The 12 is going to be 5, 7 again, and this is 4, 5. Wow, I can't type. Um, 1, 4, 8 in the column. These are 6 and 9. And in the 10 cage, this can't be a 6 because we have a 4 over here. Uh, that goes with 1 in the 10 cage. Uh, 5 now must be 2, 3. I don't think that's resolved yet. Uh, the 11, we have 5, 6, 7 left. Uh, the 7 can't go in this box anyway, so it's 5, 6. Resolves 5, 7 over here. The 5 looks down to resolve 5, 6. The 7 is resolving the 7, 8 here. 5 cage can't contain 3, so this is 1, 4, and that leaves 2, 8 here, which is resolved. 3 to finish that box. Now these are going to be 7, 8, 9. These are going to be 1, 2, 3. Uh, quite a lot of symmetry. It's not totally symmetric, but definitely nice to see that. These are 2, 6, and 9. This one's not 2. This one's not 8. All right, now we're going to have to use the diagonals at this point. I don't think I'm missing anything else. Um, this diagonal has 2, 4, 7, 3, 6, 8, so it's missing 1, 5, and 9. But
but this diagonal already has 1 and 9, so the 5 goes in the middle. But 1 can't go here, so this is 9, 1 like this. That's going to resolve a few things. The 9 looks up here, and we have 7, 8, 9 here. This is not 1, so this is uh, the 9 here. All right, and now this diagonal needs 2 and 8, which is resolved by these digits. Gives us 1, 8, 4, 1, 9, 2, 9, 6. This is a 7. This is a 3. That's going to resolve our pairs here. And to finish off, we have the right digit, 6 and a 4. And that's the solution. Really nice puzzle from Bill. Um, I like working with killer pages anyway. Um, I think all of you know that by now. Um, but the way the center resolves with the diagonals is very nice. Um, let us know how you did in the comments, and I will see you next time.